Hi, I'm Teacher Jan from Options for Learning, and today I'm going to read you a book called Helpers in My Community. Who knows what the word community means? This book is written by Bobby Kalman. He's the author of the book. What is a community? A community is a place where many people live and work together. Community helpers are people who make communities cleaner, safer, and better. Who are the helpers in your community? Can you think of who helps in your community? Some community helpers are builders, doctors, teachers, and librarians. All these people help you. Buildings and roads. Communities need buildings where people can live or work. Builders build houses, offices, schools, and stores. They also build roads and bridges. Look at this is a construction site. That means they're building something. Builders use these machines to do their work. Bulldozer, a digger, a crane, and a cement mixer. Have you ever seen these vehicles in your community? Electricity and water. People in a community need electricity. Lights, computers, television sets, and many other things cannot work without it. Electricians are people who make sure that communities have the electricity that they need. Look at their, they're up there working on the electrical lines, the power lines. People need clean water in their homes. They drink water and use it to have baths and to wash their clothes. Plumbers are community helpers who put the pipes that carry the water into our homes. Got to have water to take a bath. Do you like to take a bath? Teachers and librarians. Teachers make learning fun and exciting. They teach us how to read and write. They teach us math, science, and social studies. There's a teacher with her students in her classroom, and they're all looking at a globe. Librarians help us find books we need. Some librarians work in schools. Some librarians work in community libraries. Have you been to a library before? Is there a library in your community? Some ch other school helpers, some children walk to school and crossing guards make sure that the children cross the road safely. School bus drivers drive some of the children from home to school. Have you been on a bus before? Have you seen the crossing guard with this traffic sign? What does that traffic sign say? You're right, it's a stop sign. School nurses take care of children who are sick at school. Principals make sure that everyone follows the rules. Caretakers clean schools and fix things. Who are your school helpers? Who helps you at school? Medical helpers are doctors, nurses, and other people who keep us healthy. Some medical work helpers work in offices and others work in hospitals. Dentists are doctors who care for our teeth. They check our teeth and fix them, and they teach us how to have healthy mouths. Look at, they're teaching her how to brush her teeth. Do you know how to brush your teeth? Do you brush your teeth before you go to bed at night? Emergency helpers. Emergencies are dangerous things that happen suddenly. Emergency workers help find people and take them away from danger. Paramedics bring sick or hurt people to hospitals. They take them to hospitals quickly in ambulances. They care for the people until they arrive at a hospital. Look at they're loading that person into the back of an ambulance. Have you seen the ambulance in your, in your community before? What sound does an ambulance make? Firefighters fight fires in buildings. They also fight forest fires. They rescue people and animals, and they risk their lives to help others. Firefighters drive big trucks to fires. 
How many have you seen a fire truck in your community? Look at the fire. Police officers protect people in their communities and they make sure that people do not break the law. They help people who are in trouble. Do you have policemen in your community? Have you seen their cars they drive? Or the sound that they make when the siren is on? Police officers talk to children about how to be safe in their, commu safe in their community. Kind helpers or volunteers are kind helpers who help other people. They do not get paid for their work, but their jobs are very important. You can be a volunteer too. You can help the earth by planting seeds or picking up trash. How else could you help? Can you think of other ways that you could help? Recycling. Hmm, who recycles? And that is helpers in my community. What helpers do you have in your community?